so this expression son of the most high has no value it's just like an expression in the idiomatic sense in Jews because they say son means a prophet of God as why Bible says Adam the son of God I said it just now Luke chapter 3 verse 38 and then Jesus also said about this thing in John chapter 10 verse 30 when Jews said that you are doing blasphemy by calling yourself son of God or making yourself equal to God then he explained it he said is it not written in your law that ye are gods who Jews <clears throat> 82nd Psalm you are the children of God the most high then in the book of Exodus in chapter 4 where it says God is speaking to Moses says, behold I have made you a God to Pharaoh and your brother Aaron thy shall be a prophet and these statements when you see Jesus says clearly I don't want to go into that and then after that they were start picking stone against him they said as many good works I'm reading John chapter 10 verse number 30 on words as many good works I have shown you from my father and out of from which good work you are stoning me for Jew says we are not stoning you for the good works but we are stoning you that thou being a man make up thyself a God what did he say after that? Did he say, yes, I agree with you? As you Christian says, no, dear. Yes, this is what it means. No. Then he says, it not written in your law that ye are gods. And he said, whom the word has come. Say ye of him whom the father has sanctified and sent into this world. Thou blasphemous. Because you said that you are son of God, which is nothing. Because you are being called gods in your Bible. Who? Jews. This is the explicit you know, statement of Jesus Christ in a defense of this ideology of being, you know, son of God. So, son of the most high, then what happens after that? You will get, angel said to Mary, mark my words, from here you have to be very attentive. Angel said to Mary, that your son, he will take his father's throne, David. And he will rule over the house of Jacob forever. And his power or whatever his ruling will be forever. I would like to ask these Christian missionaries. Which throne of David was given to Jesus Christ at his time? Give me one quotation from the Bible. Which throne of David was given? Sorry. Which ruling was given to Jesus Christ over the house of Jacob in the Bible? Please quote me one verse and that is enough. 